Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and today I'm going to be going over the new Ultimate Legend cards that came out this uh, weekend, this Saturday. Uh, just like every Saturday, two new Legends are released. So first is the Ultimate Legend John Mackey, 99 overall tight end. Gives plus 1 to catch in traffic, and plus 11 to pull ground and pound and short pass chemistry. So... For his general stats, they're all pretty balanced, minus the strength. They're all low to mid-90s, jumping at 81. Uh, the 72 strength is a little low, but it's fine. Makes up for it with a 93 trucking, very good. 90 stiff arm, 92 route running, 93 release, really good for a tight end. Uh, Subpar blocking stats, but uh, you're probably using John Mackey as a receiver, opposed to a run and pass blocking tight end. So now I'm going to compare the stats between the 99 one and his original 94 card. So it goes up 2 in trucking, up 4 in elusiveness, up 2 in ball carrier vision, up 10 in stiff arm, which is huge, up 8 in spin, up eight in, er, up 7 in juke, up 2 in carry and route running, uh, up 5 in release, which release is, is really good for a tight end uh, for them to get off the line and uh, catching traffic and spec catch stayed the same. Now for his general, uh, all-around general stats for every card, uh, speed went up 6, uh, strength went up 5, still pretty low strength too. Uh, 86 agility, uh, that went up 4, uh, up 2 in acceleration, up 4 in awareness, up 5 in catching, and he stayed the same in jumping at 81, and he already had a pretty good stamina at 90 and a good injury at 97, so there wasn't really a need to improve either of those, the jumping could have gone up a little bit. But uh, one of the big stats for tight end is blocking. Uh, you're probably using Mackey as a receiving tight end. So the poor pass, block, footwork, and strength aren't that big of a deal. But there are a lot of good sets that involve a blocking tight end uh, for running. And he just doesn't have it. The run block strength is 74, which is it's above average, I think. Uh, 67 run block footwork is way below. And impact blocking at 75 is not terrible. Let's hop into the next card, Franco Harris, 99 overall fullback, I can't even talk, fullback, gives plus 2 to strength and plus 8 to long pass and plus 13 to short, uh, or speed run chemistry. Uh, you can see all of his general stats pretty balanced, all low to mid 90s with a couple of mid to high 80s. Uh, he's got some good moves, he's got a good stiff arm at 95, good spin move and juke move at 86 and 84 respectively, a good spec catch so he can receive out of the backfield with 88 catching and 90 spectacular catch, uh, coupled with an 82 catch in traffic, 78 route running, and a beastly 96 trucking. So his general base everybody stats, uh, he went up 2 in speed, up 6 in strength, up 5 in agility. Up 7 in acceleration, up 5 in awareness, up 4 in catching, and stayed the same with an 85 jumping, the same with both really good stamina and injury at 93 and 96, but uh, he now became kind of a speed, not a threat, but a speedier fullback with 90 speed and 93 acceleration, making him a bit of a threat for a receiver with his high trucking. Uh, with a fullback, you want to look at blocking because you like to use your fullback to block uh, a decent amount of the time. And so his run blocking is stellar at 90 run block strength and footwork at 88. Went up 4 in both of those stats. Also went up 4 in pass block. 3 in pass block footwork. And he went up 6 in impact blocking. Really good bringing it up to an 87 with uh, both pass blocking stats at 75. And then moving on to comparing him to with his catching and running stats he went up seven in trucking to a beastly 96 uh 13 uh, in elusiveness 77 decent elusiveness especially for a fullback uh 90 ball carrier vision 95 stiff arm like i said amazing stiff arm good spin and juke went up four and five uh carrying went up six so you're not gonna have to worry about fumblings coupled with that trucking and all that stuff he should not fumble and he's got some decent receiving stats but that's gonna do it for uh, the new Ultimate Legends, Mackey is the collection, as you can see it gives you 7500 coins and the Mackey card, and you can pull the Franco Harris out of packs, I believe, I think, I think that's how it goes, and just like all the other Legends, you do the collection with the rookies. But that's going to do it for this video, guys. Hope you all enjoyed. Drop a like if you did, subscribe if you haven't, and let me know if you are going to be picking up any of these new cards. And I'll catch you guys later. Peace out, guys.